Hi, we're the Gingard family. I'm Julie, Dylan, Larry, and Addison. <laughs> Dylan fell sick in July of 2019. Um, we didn't realize what he had until we had to get rushed to Halifax, Nova Scotia, which is four and a half hours from our hometown. We're from Bathurst in Brunswick. So then you go there, you don't know where to go, what's going on or whatnot. Um, Ronald McDonald House, amazing. They're, they're there to make you feel at home. Uh, they make you feel as if that if you need anything, uh, concerns, doctor appointments, meals, um, they're gonna be there to help you guys. McDonald's Fries for RMHC Atlantic helps maritime families when they need it most. My name is Wayne Kenneth. I'm an owner operator for McDonald's here in Cape Breton, right from Glace Bay to Anaganish. A portion of our sales from each fries goes towards our capital campaign to fund our new Ronald McDonald House. So far, there's been $24 million raised with the help of the federal government, the provincial government, McDonald operators, and through the support. We have $1 million to go and we'll continue with this fry campaign until we reach that target. In Cape Breton, we were able to help 81 families pre-pandemic with 533 nights at the house, which saved the families over $145,000 in expenses for hotels and meals and miscellaneous things. In Nova Scotia, the Ronald uh, McDonald House has uh, helped families from across the province save over $400,000. And here in the Maritimes, uh, there's been a savings of over a million dollars between the Maritime provinces for those people that are visiting the house. From the heart, um, if they wouldn't have been there, we don't know what we would have done. Uh, we all know that a hotel room is not the same price as staying at the Ronald McDonald House. Um, you wouldn't have had the support of other families that understand what you're going through. You wouldn't have meals made for you in case you had a um, long day at the hospital that you came home and you didn't want to eat or you didn't want to have supper, but they were there to make you feel like that you always would have somebody and you have the support, so. <laughs> the house gives them a non-hospital environment to stay in that house, which feels like a home from away from home. They're able to meet other families that are facing medical challenges and support one another. And we all need that, especially dealing with the pandemic and everything else that we have in life. You met other sick kids uh, that they all understand uh, what you've been going through. Uh, and Addison, how did you feel following us and following Dylan's story? How did you feel? You got Good. it? Good. <laughs> Keep on donating, keep on making sure that, spread the word, um, Ronald McDonald House, we need, we need them. We need the support, we need, the new house is gonna be so nice to have.